Hi, my name's Jenny. I'm from the Sewing Palace in Helena, Montana, and I'm here to tell you about AccuQuilt. It's a wonderful fabric cutting system, and we're a new signature dealer for their products. They have a great variety of dies to cut your fabric in all shapes and sizes. And the next thing I'm going to show you is the cutters. So you have a great selection of cutters. They have the Go Baby, which is this cutter. It's very portable and it holds smaller dies, great for crafting or a new sewer. Then they have the Go Big, which is this cutter. It also folds up like a suitcase and it is used by cranking, which I'm going to show you. you. Use the cranker and you're going to run the die through to cut your fabric. And then they have the Go Big, which is an electronic cutting system and it has a motor in it. This also folds up so it's very portable, very easy to use and it's awesome. So next I'm going to show you some cutting. Stay tuned. Alright, let's talk about the cutters because that's the first decision that you're going to make and see what fits best for you. There are three choices and we'll talk about the Go Baby first. This is a cranker cutter system so when it's opened up you crank and the dies will go through it. It opens up like so. It's perfect for crafts, kids, small projects. It's six pound, or eight pounds and it's about six inches wide. So the dies that will fit through this cutting system are six inches wide. So it's a very portable system. If you want to cut something bigger, if you're making more quilts, if you want bigger sizes, then you would go to the Go Big. So that's this system here. The opening in this system is 10 inches. It also folds up like a little suitcase. It's very portable. It's a little bit heavier. It is 15 pounds. Again, it's a cranking system, so if you're in a place that doesn't have electricity, these two cutters would be a great choice. 6 inch, 10 inch. Now, you can also look at the large system, which is electric. So this is an electric system and you, this is a little bit heavier, it folds up, it's 23 pounds, but the opening in this is 14 inches. All of these systems, you can cut six layers, six layers of fabric at one time. So this is going to really increase your time in cutting. It's more accurate. It's also very helpful if you have some, any fatigue in your hands. It's very, very accurate in regards to remember when you're cutting and your ruler slips, so you're not going to have that. It's 90% faster. Um, and you're just going to crank out some cutting. So let me show you the dies so that you can kind of see the differences in the dies. These are six inch wide dies. This is a uh, half square triangles and a little four patch or um, two and a half inch squares. This one right here is flying geese. So there's two different color foams. The blade is recessed inside this foam. It's very safe. You're not going to cut your hands on it. But these are two six inches. So this can go in the small system the baby or in here or in here. You can also take on the electric cutter and butt two of these together and run it through the system. So this really increases your size. On the 10 inch wide one you can only run one at a time. Then there are other dies and there are oodles of shapes and sizes. This one is a 10 inch die and it's cutting two and a half inch squares. It's cutting nine of them at a time and then you could cut six layers. Can you imagine how many two and a half inch squares you can get out of just this? So this would go through the go, uh, the go system or the go big. This would not fit in the baby. Okay? So that's another thing to think about. And then here we are with an exclusive go big cutter. Again, these come in lots of shapes and sizes. We'll show you some of the ones that we have here. This will only go in this system here. It won't fit in the go. So those are some choices you have to make um, on sizes. Are you a quilter that quilts quite frequently? Do you make a ton of quilts and need a lot of cutting done? Are you maybe making one to two quilts a year and you just want to make smaller ones? This may be a good choice. Or you want a cranker system that's just going to help you crank through some layers. Or do you really want to get an assembly line going? Remember, it's going to be accurate and much better on your wrists and you're going to have a great time cutting. All right, you've decided on an AccuQuilt cutter system. Now let's show you all the dies that are available because there are tons. So if you're into applique, there's lots of applique cutting systems. There's specialty systems. You can cut different size blocks. So those are a huge assortment and we are your headquarters for ordering any of the AccuQuilt dies, cutters, and systems. There are also strip cutters, alphabets, 
all kinds of wonderful things. There is also for quilters the cube system. So the cube system is sitting behind me and I'm going to show you that here in a second. I'm going to unfold one so you can see that. We also have storage system for all your dies and if you want to go to retreats or go to classes we have a great way to get it from point A to point B. So let's look here at one of the cube systems. The cube systems make a bazillion blocks. They make 72 blocks and they come in different sizes. So this is a cube system. I'm going to go ahead and pull it out so that you can see what's going to happen when you get a cube. So when you start with a cube, you'll get all of these dies with patterns, all of these shapes, you'll get a DVD and a mat. So all of these dies are different cuts and angles for blocks. When you start with a cube, you can get it in 6 inch, 8 inch, 10 inch, 9 inch, and 12 inch. So those are some of the cubes behind me. Let me pull this down so you can see how many blocks you can get started with just one cube. So when you start with a cube and you pick the size, you can make 72 blocks. All right, now that you've chose a cutter, let's talk a little bit about the dies. There's a great assortment of dies for you to choose from, from cute craft projects to gorgeous applique to tons of piecing. They come in different sizes. You can make full quilts. We do have this quilt made up. And then you also get strip cutters, alphabets, which are behind me. So there's two and a half inch strip cutters so you can make your own jelly rolls. Then you also have the ability to make lots of different size blocks. So that's the cube system. I'm going to tell you about that. You also have nice storage systems. And if you want to go to a retreat, you want to go to a class, we also have a great way to make it portable with wheels. So we are your headquarters for ordering any AccuQuilt products. We have tons of dies. We're happy to help you. And let's talk a little bit about the cube system. So the cube system is this system that's up behind me. It comes in different sizes. You've got a six inch, an eight inch, a 10 inch, and a 12 inch cube system. Oh, and a nine, they just added a nine. So the cube system is this system right here, and it's very well organized. You'll just slide these easy tabs out. I'm gonna take one out so you can see it. And when you pull this out, all of your dies are in here, and each die has another pattern that's with it. So for instance, this is the eight inch cube. Here is a half square triangle that is four inches that will make an eight inch square when you make a couple of them. There's a pattern. And then you also have a DVD and a mat that you'll get out of the cube system and all these different shapes. When you buy a cube system, you can make a bazillion blocks. You pick the size that you want and you can make 72 blocks with just that one cube system. So let me show you what that would look like. These are 72 different blocks that you can make with the cube system. So you would pick your size, six inch, eight inch, nine inch, 10 inch, or 12, and then you'd be able to make this many blocks. But there's also companions that go to the cube system. So if you wanted to look at a companion, you would add some corners and shapes, and then that would expand your system to 144 blocks. But wait, there's more. If you want to add another companion system, which is angles, and it would expand your blocks to 216. So that's just with three cubes. So you can have a great assortment of quilting blocks to choose from, from just the cube system, or you can make a really cute quilts from some of the dies that we showed you earlier. All right, you've chosen a cutter. You've seen all the wonderful dies that you have to choose from. And now I'm gonna show you a little bit of the cutting. So what you're gonna start with is your um, cutting die, and this will have your different shapes. So on this one, I'm gonna cut some half square triangles. So the other cool thing that you can do is you can get your pieces of fabric and lay them right sides together. So when you take them out of the cutter, they're ready to sew. So I'm gonna fold this so that I'm cutting through four layers. and I'm gonna cover up that shape, like so. And then for every die, you're gonna need a um, mat. So they come in different sizes. This is a six inch die, this is six by 12, and they will just match the size of the cutter. Then you'll place that cutter into the system, and then you will kind of give it a little bit of a push 
and then start cranking. So I'm cranking right through. Here we are. So here it is. And then you'll just pull this off. And look at this. How cool is that? So then you have a half square triangle unit. Now, if you can look closely at this half square triangle unit, what's really cool about it is the dog ears are cut off. So when you go to sew this, they line up perfectly and you know where your quarter of an inch seam is and you're gonna just sew it right down and have a beautiful half square triangle. So that was a couple of layers just making a half square triangle with a crank cutter. Remember the Go is a crank cutter and so is the Go Baby. Let's go look at the electric cutter next. So that is right here and you will also need a die. Remember we can cut dies that are just a little bit bigger with this and you'll need a mat. So this die I have flying geese. So this is my flying geese unit and these are my sky units for the goose. So I have six layers of fabric all laid and some people think that when you're using a cutting system like this you're going to waste fabric but you're going to see it's just beautiful you're not going to waste any here's a strip of fabric and i've cut it just a little bit bigger than this unit that i'm going to cut and i'm going to fan fold the fabric over top like so and then i'll get it ready to put in my cutter i'll cover it up with the die or the mat and then you'll place your cutter in and then there's no cranking involved in this it's just gonna cut it right through the system and pop it out the other side all right so now we have our die with all of these units for our flying geese so look how cool this goose unit is going to go together again we have those dog ears already cut off and I have a bunch, look how cool that is. I have a bunch of flying geese ready to sew in my sewing machine. So aren't you excited? Come on down to the Sewing Palace. We have lots of AccuQuilt products and classes. You can come and test drive our AccuQuilt cutting system. Thanks, bye now.